So Missy, this is your tutorial like explanation on what I was doing in the previous movie, uh, my first point of view with Boogang. So it was pretty much <clears throat> just finger rolls where I slowly, so first I spin them in the same direction and I just use my fingers to keep them spinning in the same kind of momentum you see that's probably the first move everyone learns and then I did some wrist rolls oops sloppy ones which you're just gonna use there are tutorials only on how to do a proper wrist roll but basically you're gonna hold it really gentle so the plane is always kind of flat, right? And the trick that I use when, for instance, my blades ran out of sync like this, right? It's, I find it easier to put them back together if I use uh, finger rolls and then restart my wrist rolls, uh, then trying to, you know, fix it only with the wrists but that's just me, I don't know but anyways, hope other people can benefit from this uh, also when you're spinning the blades against each other no matter I think it doesn't matter, no it doesn't the, the exact direction so when you're practicing your wrist rolls you're gonna have to move your body especially if you have short arms like I do so this is how you do it and this is how it looks like well except that you won't have this brick stuck to your head anyways so another cool trick is to roll inside your body inside your body like this so we have a uh, we pass the heads inside your arms push them and then you pass the tail inside your arms push them hands tails. it's a pretty cool move to learn because it's easy and it looks good and it's easy to connect this one with other oops ah, sorry anyways I hope you enjoyed this and happy spinning